homeowner in Kailua has seriously gone green. His newly built home is the first in Hawaii to be certified by as green by the National Association of Home Builders. An open house is being held at the Keolu Hills home tomorrow and will benefit the Honolulu Habitat for Humanity. KITV 4's Dan Meisenthal is standing by live at the Kailua home. And Dan, you're looking a little green this morning. <laughs> I am feeling green, Paul. As a matter of fact, I hear live on this incredible home over here. Now, it's just about complete. Once again, the home is going to be open to the public tomorrow. It actually burnt down about a year ago, and it's been reconstructed in this green fashion. And right now, I want to introduce to you one of the people who helped build this home. This is Bossert Builders, Leanne Bossert. And good morning, Leanne. Thanks for being with us. Really appreciate it. Good morning. Thanks for coming. And the first question I have to ask you is, oh, we've all heard of LEED certification. Now you have this green certification from this national organization. What's the difference? Um, well, for this green certification, you have to get a minimum number of points in every category of being green. In the LEED certification, you could pay a lot of money in one area and be certified, but the other areas may not be so green. I see. I see. Okay, great. We're going to keep talking to Leanne a little bit later uh, about tomorrow's open house. But first, let me show you. This is, is going to be the living room right here. Very big space. We're talking about 3,600 square feet here at this home here in Kailua. And now I want to introduce you to the other half of Bossert Builders. This is uh, Nick Bossert. And good morning to you, Nick. Good morning. And first of all, so we got this huge home here. It's a little bit bigger than the home that used to be standing here. Now, is this a lot more expensive, say, if we built it in a traditional style or, or the old style? What would be the cost difference? Um, there's little to no cost difference actually there. Um, this home that we put together, we did it for the exact same price that a traditional home would have been built for. And how much was that about? Um, if we would have had to replace the entire foundation, it would have been right around $600,000. But you folks uh, managed to use uh, some of that foundation and then, and then build from there? Yeah, we saved about 50% of the existing foundation. Very cool. And, and what makes this house green? Show us some of the green uh, aspects of the home. Well, a couple of things that you can't see is our EcoBat insulation and our Isonine insulation. And there's also um, solar reflective shingles on the roof. And then we do have rainwater catchment that you right, can actually see right over here. So check that out. That's right there. That's going to hold about 50 gallons. You can use that uh, to water your, your yard and everything like that and, and great stuff. And, and we're going to be walking down to the living room right now. Uh, the boss is going to lead us that way. But real fast, I want to show you this. We have, a, of course, a water heater, solar water heater. Of course, you have to have a solar water heater. And there it is right there as we continue our tour of the home. Back into the family room, and the bathroom is amazing. Check this bathroom out. Right over here, it is just very impressive. That big walk-in shower there, ADA compliant. Uh, of course, the, uh, the, the toilet there is, uh, doesn't use as much water as your traditional toilet as uh, uh, so many items that are green here. We're going to keep walking down over here. Just want to make sure our cameraman's okay. And, and Nick, we could show a feature right here, as a matter of fact. We came down these steps, and we can see something else that's uh, one of the green features here. Yeah, this is some of our man-made lumber. You've got the uh, man-made plywood, and you also have the uh, bamboo, which is both sustainable and renewable. Very cool. And, of course, the last thing we really have to show here is the kitchen. Everyone loves bathrooms and kitchens. Check out this kitchen. You have the island there. You have all kinds of neat stuff. You can see uh, the family room over here, where the dining room will also go. And so it's just a beautiful home. Once again, 3,600 square feet, and it's going to be open to the public. And when can people come down here tomorrow, Leanne? Um, we're going to be open from 1 to 5 p.m. tomorrow, Sunday. And it's for a good cause. Yes, we're going to have a raffle to benefit Honolulu Habitat for Humanity so that we can use our success to give back to a great charity. All right, great stuff there. And uh, let me show you one more thing. First of all, I want to say thank you, Leanne. Thank you, Nick. Uh, they woke up so early in the morning. Of course, they've been hard at work. But uh, let's do this last one thing here. And uh, this is one of the master bedrooms. It, it's, a, it's a beautiful home here. And like they said, a green can be affordable. So it's definitely something you should look into if you're thinking about remodeling or building a brand new home. Reporting live from Kailua, I'm Dan Meisenzal for KITV4 News. Paul and Jody, back to you. Thanks a lot, Dan. Are you ready to move in? <laughs> If you I want to am. see the oh, I'm so ready to move in. <laughs> it is, it is, it is, I mean, the smell and the kitchen I know and the, that oh, the bathrooms, oh, it is, yeah. It, yeah, it's spectacular. I can smell it from here. Thanks, Dan.